Hey there! In this video, I'll show you how to create an interaction with iSpring Suite. Interactions are a great way to create engaging online courses without having to know any programming. All interactions are published in HTML5 format, so they look great on desktops, laptops, tablets, or smartphones. Let's get started. Open iSpring Suite. Select Interaction and click Create. You can choose from 14 different templates, including steps, guided image, and hotspot to present information in an engaging way. Let's use the accordion template. Here we go. Now, let's start adding content. You can change the title right up here. Then, put some text right down here. Under Insert, you can add media content. Let's add a picture. Looks great. You can add a bunch of other cool media content like video, audio, characters, backgrounds, and objects from the iSpring content library. You also have the option to enable an intro slide. This adds an introduction before the main interaction. To add new panels, click Add Panel in the Accordion tab. When you're done, you'll have a nice, fluid series of panels that make it easy for your learners to absorb new information. You can fine-tune the colors and properties of your interaction up here. Let's take a look at properties. You can choose to show or hide the title. Next, select a text animation here. Now, customize the interaction player. Choose a font, turn the navigation buttons on or off, and adjust the button corner radius. Perfect. You can also adjust the interaction size up here. Fine tune the color settings and create your own custom presets. To change text labels, click text. From there, you can select a language, change button labels, and modify player messages. Once everything looks good, click Apply and Close to save your settings. OK, let's go ahead and publish this interaction. You can save it directly to your computer in HTML5 format. Upload it to iSpring Cloud, an online workspace for teamwork and course collaboration, to iSpring Learn LMS or export it as a package for uploading to another LMS using one of the supported LMS standards, like SCORM or XAPI. I'm going to publish this interaction to iSpring Cloud. I'll name the interaction and select a project to upload it to. If you want to include the source files of your project, just click this box and they'll be uploaded to iSpring Cloud. Now click Publish. Once the upload is complete, click Manage Content. This opens iSpring Cloud, where you can preview your interaction. You can easily share your interaction with your team or customers, gather feedback, and make adjustments. Let's make it accessible to anyone with a shareable link. To embed this interaction on your website or blog, copy and paste the embed code. You can upload a cover image here. For added security, set a password to prevent unauthorized access and sharing. Now let's go back and see how to publish to your computer. Name your interaction and choose where to save it on your computer. Then click Publish. This saves your interaction in HTML5 format in the selected folder. And that's how you can make training content more engaging using interactive templates. Explore the possibilities and see what you can create. 